All right, how to solve a Sudoku puzzle. Make sure that you have a pen. I mean, pen, pencil, sorry, not pen, pencil. Because um, the reason why you need a pencil, so they, like if you put down seven, you see that it's in a different row. See, there's a seven right there. That way you could just simply erase it. Okay, so with the pen, you can't do that. Um, there we go. Okay. So, how to solve a Sudoku puzzle? Um, there's boxes, like this. Okay, it contains the numbers 1 through 9. In each and every single little box. Okay, they can't be twice. So, for example, you can't have a 1 here and 1 here. Okay, you can't do that. It's very hard. Okay, um... And that's the same thing with the rows or columns. You have the numbers 1 through 9. They can't be twice. So, for example, you can't have 1 here and 1 here. And that's the same thing going across. Numbers 1 through 9. You can't have a 1 here and a 1 here, okay? Every Sudoku puzzle can be solved, except for the ones you create, unless other you know how to create it. Of course, I'll be YouTube in another video, eventually, on how to create your own Sudoku puzzle. So, let's get started. Let's solve with this box, okay? Make sure that, let's say the one goes here, okay? Make sure that there are no other ones in that row, column, and inside that box. And obviously, it isn't. So we're going to put a little subscript 1. Okay. Let's go on to 2. Well, 2 is already in the box, so you don't need to worry about 2. A 3. A 3 could go here, here, or here. Now let's check that. Let's check right here. Going across, do you see a 3? No. Okay. Going down, do you see a 3? Yes. So obviously this 3 cannot go there. Now let's check here. A 3 going across? Yes, there's a 3 going across. Okay, now let's check here. Remember, there's a subscript. Could three go down? Okay, it could go like that. Could a three go across? Yes. Now, when you have a three like this, make sure that you like literally in your head cross out that row because you know the three cannot go in either of those spots. And obviously it can't go there because of that. So, um, obviously the three goes there. Now this is when your eraser comes in handy. You erase a little subscript one. And there you go. That's how you solve one of the squares. Okay, I'm not gonna solve the entire thing, but eventually you get down to that. Eventually you do. I would suggest you start out with easy. Then go to medium. Then go to hard. Then go to the hardest one you've ever done. Of course, I can do the diabolical. That's the hardest. So pretty much the rules of Sudoku. All right, yeah, I have to memorize them off the top of my head. Okay. No. Start by filling the, in the boxes so that every row, column, and 3x3 three three mini grid contains each digit from 1 to 9 only once, which is pretty much what I said. Use a pencil so you can erase any mistakes. Do not rush. There's no time limit. Of course, the numbers that are already given cannot be changed. Keep in mind that there is one correct solution for each puzzle. Using these tips, now you can get started. Okay, and then I'm not going to mention the tips because like it's going to take forever to download. So thanks for watching.